So we're making progress. This part of the video is about uh, the tops and closing wheels and uh, how you can tell you have too much downforce on the closing wheels. Um, the Thompson is a spiked wheel. I think you've seen it in one of my earlier videos. Um, and what it does is it projects force into the furrow instead of down. So uh, your rubber closing wheels push down and do some firming for your seed. Your tops and closing wheels uh, work with the Keaton seed firmer. The Keaton firmer pushes the seed into the dirt and then the closing wheels crush the sidewalls around it. So if you have too much force on your tops and wheels, they're gonna blow up the trench. And what I mean there is, uh, look along the row here, Occasionally you'll see some clods of dirt sticking up out of the trench. And that's where the force was so great it worked in and just blew the trench up. So um, you might dislodge your seed. Uh, you might have clods of dirt sitting over your furrow. Um, so this pass I had done it on a setting of three, three notches. And uh, it's not too bad out here in the main field, but where I had uh, a little bit looser tilled soil, it was uh, blowing up the trench more. So that's how you check your settings on the Thompsons. Um, they never get perfect. And uh, I may go back to a setting of three here in the main field because I'm not seeing too much of the problem. Thompson's, that's one thing you're looking for. There's some uh, clods right there. That's where the trench blew out. 